Buckeye Nation, OH, IOs down in the comments. Happy Wednesday, guys. So we got some big news late last night. Uh, Tate Martell officially gone from the Ohio State. He's headed down to Miami. Uh, we got a tweet last night from my guy, Vince Sapienza, from right here in Vegas, Fox 5 Vegas. Uh, he tweeted out, breaking per sources, Bishop Gorman grad and Ohio State backup quarterback Tate Martell will be transferring to the University of Miami. Official announcement coming tomorrow. Well, Tate couldn't wait till tomorrow. My man put up this sick graphic on his uh, Twitter and Instagram, uh, Vegas to my to MIA. Uh, so, yes, he is gone. Where he'll be joining his former teammate, Brevin Jordan, big tight end prospect that's a freshman this year, and Bubba Bolden. He used to be a USC, and uh, now he's transferring down to Miami. Uh, he plays safety. Dude's huge, 6'3", 201. I think this is a great move for Tate. Uh, he's going to be down there with his friends. Uh, he's going to have a chance to shine and a chance to start because I don't think they're having a quarterback come back next year. Yeah, I think their quarterback is a – no, they have a freshman that's down there, but he should be able to beat this guy out because the guy threw 13 touchdowns and six interceptions. Uh, yeah, I think it's a great move for Tate. He'll be able to shine down there. I compare Tate to – uh, like a Johnny Menzel in college. Uh, he could have a little um, Baker Mayfield in him. Uh, he's just a very – he's a fighter, and I wish he would have stayed at Ohio State because my concern now for our Buckeyes is, say Justin Fields gets hurt, who's our backup? Baldwin, from what everybody keeps saying, is going to be a stud, but I'd rather have somebody who I know is going to be on the field. As soon as we put him on the field, he's ready to go. And, you know – Tate showed that last year with a couple plays that he had. Uh, but it's kind of tough, man, when you have to play behind Dwayne, who's throwing up the ball, having record-breaking season, and then you have another kid who's coming in who can have the same type of season that Dwayne just had. So uh, I'm happy for Tate. Hopefully he'll be able to shine down in Miami. Hopefully he doesn't get distracted because, let's be real, it's Miami. South Beach is legit <laughs> so Buckeye Nation comments down below let me know what you guys think is this the right move for Tate do you think he should have stayed at Ohio State and what do you think of our backup quarterback situation so right now we have Fields Baldwin and then another freshman coming in um, and I think they're trying to recruit one more quarterback uh, so let me know what you guys think down in the comments section I appreciate the love you guys went crazy on the last video on Monday it's over a thousand views, which is huge for your boy. So I thank you guys so much. And we pass a thousand subscribers on this channel. Thank you guys for all the love and support. And the grind doesn't stop here. We're on the road to 10,000 subscribers now. And then after that, we just going to go to wherever, you know, the good, the good Lord takes us. So thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you smash that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you're brand new. Don't forget, hit my links down in my description. Follow your boy on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at Big C Gat Game. And we'll probably talk again here coming up real soon because, you know, our Buckeyes, there's always something going on, man. Have a great day, guys. Two fingers in the air. Peace.